Hi guys, it's Luke from Luke's Mushrooms again. It's Sunday the 20th of June 2021. I'm in Czechia in a coniferous forest in a bit higher altitude. And there are, today there are quite many of Boletus luridiformis, the Scarletina bolete. I didn't record the beginning, but this is what I have in my basket already. And I started to record now because I found very beautiful groups of those mushrooms. For example, these two. Now when recording I can see that the left one is already bad because there is some mold on it with some yellow drops of gutation. There is one more here but this is almost eaten by slugs. And if we do a few steps further we will see another group, a small one here, few bigger ones behind it, and there are some more, or is it just one, here. I will take some pictures of them and take some of them if they will be okay. So I will pick them but I don't think I will take many of them because when I was taking pictures I noticed that they are infected by mold at least few of them. So the other one, I am not even going to take it, but this one is nice. So far I don't see any mold, so hopefully it's okay also inside. Here I will start with the smallest one. This one must be good for sure. Also quite pretty. And about this one I was worried that it's infected by mold here at the side. But I don't think it's mold so this one should also be okay actually. That would mean we have four nice scarlet bolides and I'm going to clean them now. This one is good. as well. This is a big one, but it's also healthy inside. This is actually one of the reasons why people like scarlet bolides so much that they are not so often full of worms in comparison to yesterday's summer zeps. This is a 
very different story. Basically all four of these guys are completely okay inside. So very nice find. I found most of those which I have in my basket already just growing here next to the road and currently I spotted another two this is the first one I can see the slugs were again faster than me but let's check how it looks from the bottom Could be okay if I cut the bitten parts. Let's see after. And another one is here. Ah, but that one is moldy. I'm not going to take it. I moved quite far away to my most favorite forest with many oak trees. And so far I I just entered the forest and I spotted this beautiful Amanita. I don't know exactly which type it is, but I will maybe find out. And this is definitely a nice mushroom for a picture. So I took some pictures and now I know which Amanita this is. I just don't know the English or the Latin name. But uh, I will write it in the subtitles, you should see that already. And there is another small one here. And a slightly bigger one here. I discovered those two when I was making clean space here for, for the picture. Finally found something that looks like king bolits. So this was probably a summer cep. But it's totally dried out. I'm not even going to pick it out of the ground. And there is one more. This one is very huge and has interesting hole on top. It doesn't remind me anything. I will try to pick this out. It's very huge. I guess it will be full of worms, but I will see when I cut it. So far the stamp feels quite firm, so maybe we will be surprised and there will be some good stuff inside. So let's try to cut the stamp, but I don't give it many chances. Yeah. Not very nice there. It could be worse, but I think I will not take it home. I didn't have to go far to spot another one. This one is a bit smaller. And I also don't believe it will be in the perfect shape, but I want to try. The weather is very hot and dry these days, so that's why the mushrooms are not in such a good condition. I mean, especially these summer ceps, because the scarletina uh, bolides from the morning in the mountains they were in a perfect shape, but as I was uh, 
telling this I just spotted another summer sap which looks basically perfect and it's here I think this one is a good candidate for a picture after that I will pick it and clean it when I switched my camera off I looked a bit up further and spotted another summer sap it's also looking to be quite young not sure if you can see it already but here it is these two are definitely uh, good models for a picture so I will spend some time here with my camera and then we will see how it goes so let's do it This one is basically perfect. Perfect shape, there are no bites from any slug or something. So we already have two of them and this is the last one. Also looks very pretty. So these are the three champions and I'm wondering how they will look inside. So let's go one by one. This one is pretty bad but that was expected already from how it looked from outside I didn't have high hopes for this one this one's stamp is quite soft so I also expected there will be worms inside so the last hope not much better actually from this one at least the head could be okay but the others will stay here So that's it for today. I went to this forest to check if there are any summer ceps and there are a few but the quality is quite low. But what is the best about today is the scarlet bolids from the morning from the mountains which were good quantity and quality as well. So that's what I'm happy for and I'm also happy for all the pictures I was able to take today. So thank you all for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.